Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Ooh, that's bright. Let me fix the lighting. That's a little bit better. Um, so good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Blair, and I do videos here about fashion, beauty, home decor, life, and everything in between. So I would appreciate if you guys can subscribe so you don't miss out on any videos. Um, today we have a little bit more of a glam situation happening i even did false lashes for you guys like that's like next level glam for me um the struggle was real while putting them on because it's been a long time that i didn't put it on myself usually anya does it for me when i get my makeup done and i've been really loving my mascara so i didn't need to put lashes on but i was like i'm feeling a little bit sassy today so let's just put on a little bit of like more glam into it i even did like shimmery shadow here so yeah we are very much glammed got ready for the day did my hair even though again not loving it if i want to ramble about my hair we're gonna be here until tomorrow but moving on um i just want to give you guys a little bit of introduction before starting today's video of what we're gonna do what the plan of action is for today we're gonna talk about my favorite um, skincare, body care, and beauty products basically for fall and winter. Let me show you guys my OOTD and then get into the video. If we are being honest, my outfit is not my favorite because I feel like gray is just not my color. I try to love it, but I don't know. I had this top in a very rich brown um, and it was so beautiful. I was like, let me get another color too and this was the only color available. So I was like, this is a neutral color. I can't work with this, but I feel like it's a very cold color. I was struggling on what to wear on the bottom. So I went with this black um, jeans that I have from Target. You guys can see all the other sizes there. I literally have size 12, 14, and 16 of the same pants in all colors because i couldn't decide on what size to go i went with the size 14 um i have to get it a little bit altered on the legs because the legs are a little bit loose and yes i am wearing my slippers um i have to get this one a little bit altered because this is a new pair that i'm wearing it's not as loose but as i wear them within like an hour or so the fabric stretches out so that's why i have to get them altered on the legs so they sit a little bit nicely because the size 12 was too small in the waist area and size 16 is obviously very big size 14 fits really good on the waist area but the legs are a little bit big so after my very long ramble um i went with the size 14 of them uh, but yeah, I'm not loving my OOTD today because as I said, I feel like gray is not my color But since I had the tags off, we're just gonna go with it and Try to love it as much as we can. The top is from H&M. My pants are from um, Target. I have them in all the colors that it comes in which is a black a blue denim uh, this like a creamish color um, and dark green so yeah those are all the colors that they have and i got all of them because i feel like i'm gonna get a lot of views out of them and it's been a long time that i haven't worn black pants it just feels a little bit weird but yeah here's the otd of the day and obviously my slippers are from amazon i'll link them for you guys they're super cute i ordered another color as well sorry i just ate a cake i was like i have uh cake crumbs on my chin but it's all good it's all good so we're gonna start off my like essentials we're gonna start from the uh beauty category so the first things first i'm sure you guys all know about this but the hydration is very very important when it comes to fall and winter because the air is drier so the skin gets drier as well um i have been actually talking on my instagram story this morning that i don't know why all of a sudden my entire body and my face is extremely like dry every single morning i have to put a hydrating face face mask on and i double dose on my body lotion because it's just my body and my face it's just generally speaking my skin is extremely dry it's not even fall weather here we literally have a full-on sun and the weather is like high off like 90s literally it's like summer weather uh but at the same time i don't know why all of a sudden it's very dry so hydration is very very important 
So I'm gonna start off with the moisturizer that I'm using currently. This is the Kills Ultra Facial Cream. I recently started using this um, based off of Julia's recommendation. I got the small top because I didn't know if I'm gonna like it or not, but I absolutely love it. It's super hydrating and I have a combination leaning more towards dry skin. Um, I have a little bit of an oily like T-zone, just a little bit, not my forehead, but like this area is a little bit oily, uh, but the remaining is extremely dry so i have been really loving this and just go hand in hand with the moisturizer you guys know how much i love sheet masks they are just the best for hydrating your skin and i brought to show you guys two of my favorite ones these are the packs from amazon which are more affordable they come in a pack of 10 or 15 i'm not sure to be exact i think they come in a pack of 10 and each of them cost like one dollar these are the most affordable ones that actually work don't break me out they're fantastic for hydration and then to go in with a little bit more of a high-end one it's the Guerlain one this is extremely hydrating like if you have a very very dry skin you're gonna absolutely love this um or if you have a normal to combo skin you're gonna love this like on a special occasion it's just makeup looks so much better when you use this underneath and then you put your makeup on um it's just a phenomenal product so just generally speaking sheet mask and hydrating masks are a must have for me during fall and winter because my skin needs that hydration then again tied in the hydration now we're going towards the body do i even need to talk about this again because i have talked about this 100 million times on this channel or on my instagram um this is the sol de janeiro bomb bomb cream brazilian bomb bomb cream it's a phenomenal product not only it's super hydrating it has fantastic skincare properties it smells absolutely divine it literally smells like heaven it's so 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 good like there's not a body care that i think i'm gonna love it as much as i love this i love adding in a body oil during fall and winter you can use any oil that you want but i specifically love using this bio oil because um it helps with the stretch marks and it's just a very hydrating oil uh, because i have fake tan on i don't use this all the time but when i do i basically take a very generous amount of this and then drop a few drops of this in the body cream and then and go all over um, it's very very hydrating and I can't tell you the next day when I wake up how soft my skin is uh, when you apply this together give your skin like five minutes before getting dressed so it absorbs completely if not then what is the effect of it basically it's just like skincare like on your face when you apply it you have to give it a few minutes for it to absorb and then go to bed so do the same thing with this it's a phenomenal combo and like this is a must-have for me during fall and winter because my skin is extremely dry Another skincare aspect that is very important and I don't hear so many people talking about it is uh, not exfoliating your skin too much during fall and winter because it's extremely dry and by exfoliating it too much you might be damaging your skin tissue even more or if you're exfoliating your skin try to use very gentle products i don't use these products only during fall and winter i use them all year long because i have a very sensitive skin and i have to be very careful with what kind of exfoliating i'm using the one thing that i would change about my exfoliation is that i won't use it every night now my schedule is one night i'll use this one night i'll use this one which i'll let me introduce these products which is this one is a dermalogic called daily microfoliant and this is the summer friday soft reset so now i use them like one day i will use this one day i will use this but during fall and winter i would skip a day uh, for example i will use this then the next day i won't use any exfoliator and the next day i will use this so just like that first your skin doesn't get irritated because of too much exfoliation you still get the exfoliating benefits of it without basically ir irritating your skin yeah, try to not over exfoliate your skin especially during fall and winter because it can cause more damage than um, the benefit basically I don't know anyone who can go through fall and winter without some sort of lip oil lip balm um, so lip balms are essential and my favorite one is a summer Friday one this is already my second tube I absolutely love 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 this I don't only use this as a nighttime 
like mask for my lips i also use this during the day as a lip gloss because it has a beautiful sheen um, but if you want actual oil for your lips this lila b one is super cute and it also has a very fall vibe to it um, and then this is a clarence lip oil which is very hydrating as well this one is in the color 04 candy it is not this bright pink but they have other beautiful colors as well they have this uh, dark maroon color and then they have the purple one they're not very empowering colors this one is very pigmented but these ones are not that pigmented uh, this goes on so smoothly it's such a beautiful product like i would use this during the daytime so much it's just a phenomenal product so don't forget the hydration about your lips because that's the one area i feel like that everyone suffers um, from dryness during fall and winter the next beauty products are going to be my tanning products and the reason that i talk about my tanning products in a fall and winter is because most people during spring and summer can get a natural tan i wouldn't recommend laying under the sun but most people do that most people some people i don't know but um, during fall and winter, I'm a kind of person who never likes to be without my tan on because I'm very, very pale and I just don't feel my best when I don't have my tan on. And that's why these are a must have for me and specifically this brand. You guys know I'm a huge fan of Saint Tropez because these products are just one of a kind. I'm going to start off with my face tanning products, which are these two. This is the serum and this is the mist. This one is a Saint Tropez Purity vitamins uh boosting glow boosting vitamin c and d that was a mouthful i absolutely love 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 this so what i do is in the mornings when i'm using my moisturizer i'll uh, put two pumps of this in my moisturizer and go all over my face gives a beautiful glow and like the most natural looking tan to your face and then when i'm done with my skincare i'll spritz a little bit of this all over my face this is a phenomenal product. If you are a kind of person who likes having a tan face, you're gonna absolutely love this. This is the only one that I, have, that I have tried, and trust me, I have tried many that will not turn you orange, not turn you green. It will not look patchy, it will not look dry. It will be the correct amount of tan for the face. Um, it doesn't even need blending, so you basically just go all over your face, and that's about it. I honestly sometimes even use this on top of my makeup. I don't know if you're supposed to do that or not, but I sometimes do that as well. It's just a phenomenal product and um, just spray it all over your face. You don't have to touch it. It just absorbs it and that's about it. You can put your makeup on top of it as well. And as I said, sometimes I even put this on top of my makeup. Um, now moving on to the body one and these are my two favorite products for my body tanning This is the Saint Tropez self tanning express mood which is the darkest one that I have tried from their line I think they have another shade of this that is a little bit darker than this, but I have not tried it This works fantastic for me If I want to go super super dark which I won't recommend because it obviously looks, looks very unnatural. I would put two layers of this. But this is a phenomenal product. And I use this in my lower body because I just found that it works better. And for my upper body, I like to use this Saint Tropez Self Tanning Purity one. I either use the mousse or the gel. Love them. They're so natural looking. These are the only products that I use that I don't get that ugly tan lines on my hands or anywhere on my body. Both of these products, they fade so beautifully. You would never see like patchy like places on your hand if you apply them very well. And how you apply them very well is using this fantastic, fantastic mitt. And um, this is not like a fall or winter essential, but it is an essential for tanning. So I just thought I'll give it a shout out. Um, you guys know how obsessed I am with Lydia and I just like that woman cannot do any wrong in my eye uh, But she created this and I'm not saying this only because I'm obsessed with her but because it's a phenomenal product uh, Before this I was using another meat which was really good. No complaints about that But after using this one, I can never go back to that one. It blends the tan so beautifully like I can't tell you guys how beautiful this blends. It doesn't soak up all the products, so you still get the most of your product. When I wash this, barely color comes out of it. So that means it's not soaking, soaking up too much product, so your product is not getting wasted, basically. So I just thought, since I'm talking about my tanning products, I should mention this as well, because if you're a self tanner, you're gonna absolutely love, love, love this. Um, so these are my 
skincare and like beauty must-haves now i'm gonna go into a little bit more of a random uh one these two are not only fall favorites but all year long but during fall and winter i would recommend them more um the first one is this um liquid ivy i put them in this jar they don't come in this jar i just buy a big um pack of them and put them in this jar um this is a liquid ivy and here's my water i already have it in as you guys can see it's not a clear water it's a little bit milky color because it has a packet of this inside i'm the kind of person who struggles with drinking water and with fall and winter coming when the weather is cold most people struggle with drinking water and hydration is very important um, so what this does is basically triples the effects of hydration on your body so for example just putting it simple uh, if I drink one jar of this it makes my body understand that I had three of this basically it has fantastic minerals in it and because of my surgery I'm not able to drink a lot of water like not that I can't I try my best but I guess since I can't combine liquid with uh, food it makes it more difficult for me to drink water so I have been absolutely loving drinking this I get the um, flavor lemon it's like a savory lemon but not too sour and not too sweet it's fantastic actually after drinking it for a couple of days I have a hard time going back to regular water because this just tastes really good and encourages me to drink it um, so it's a phenomenal product which um, helps you with hydration specifically during fall and winter when not many people are able to drink water because it's just cold your body requ doesn't require it as much um, so I'll link that for you guys in the description box below give it a try for sure and the next product is this vital protein marine collagen and again this is not only a fall and winter favorite it's an all year long but specifically during fall and winter um, your skin is dry and obviously when you have more collagen production it can help your skin uh, with being hydrated um, I personally love this marine collagen which is the fish one the other one has a picture of a cow I believe I prefer this one over the cow one because it has more collagen uh, this doesn't have a taste this does not have a smell I am very picky about my morning coffee like nothing can disturb my morning coffee if it doesn't smell like coffee or doesn't taste like coffee I'm not gonna drink it so I don't even feel this is in my coffee so I add a scoop of this in my coffee and it's just a fantastic fantastic product to have specifically during fall and winter when the air is so dry and you need all the collagen production so I have this food favorite and it's very rare for me to talk about a food favorite because I'm just not a foodie and my mom got this a few weeks ago from I think CVS this is the best thing that I had for fall these are just like leaf looking cookies they're so delicious they're called maple leaf cream cookies um, we opened this yesterday look how much of it we already had we literally have like five of it left it's so 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 good i'm not into fall drinks or fall foods at all because i'm not the biggest cinnamon fan i know surprising i'm just not a fan of cinnamon and everything during fall involves some sort of a cinnamon but these ones are phenomenal so if you are um in america and you have cvs um please try this or i'll google them and see if i can find them on amazon or something they're so 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 good um another uh fall and winter favorite which is not gonna shock many of you but it might shock some of you if you know me you know i'm the biggest rosé drinker i absolutely love rosé like if i could drink rosé all day long i literally would but when it comes to fall and winter there is something about switching it to red wine and i'm sure a lot of you guys will agree with me rosé is more of a summer and spring kind of wine during fall, I love me a uh, red wine. My sister started drinking Pinot Noir and I somehow turned into a Pinot Noir drinker. Pinot Noir red wine is a fall and winter favorite. It just feels good to curl up by the TV, have the fire on, our fake fire on because we live in LA and we don't need the real fire. Um, if I just have the fire on and just watch the Christmas movie, it's just the vibe. I honestly can't wait for that vibe because this weather is not helping. We have 90 degree weather and I can't wait for cozy nights in with a glass of wine. 
it cannot be a fall essential video without some candles and we all know how much I absolutely love the white company candles this is the autumn and the fireside candles from the white company they smell like heaven the autumn one has a very fresh scent these are not like bath and body works candles they don't smell that strong they're not as intense um, these are very subtle. Um, I absolutely love the Bath and Body Works candles. Um, I'm actually waiting for their annual sale that they have during, I think it's November or December, I'm not sure. I think it's November or end of October um, that the candles are on Supercell. I'm waiting for that to purchase a few of them. Uh, but these ones are a different feeling. The Fireside one has a little bit more of a woody scent, while the Autumn one has a little bit of a sweet hint to it um these are very unique smells very unique they smell like a cottage but a luxury one i don't know how to tell you guys they're just phenomenal products if you've never tried the white company candles you must they're an essential um i personally love them for their slick look of them like how slick does this look as much as i love the bath and body works candle for their smell of them but i don't like their jars like i know you can buy one of those jars like one of those candle holder holders and put them inside of them but nothing will look as sleek as these ones look so i had to mention my favorite 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 candles for fall and winter these are all my essentials and favorite for fall and winter i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button and i will see you guys on my next video bye